Hey guys, what's up? It's Hyperlink here. Welcome back to a brand new video. And today in this video, we are doing something completely different on this channel. It's something I've never done before. Something I I was always kind of scared of doing because I don't like horror games, okay? I don't like them one bit. I'm too much of a crybaby, a scaredy cat, or as most adults will call me, a bitch. I don't like horror games really at all. Like at all. I like horror movies. I love them. It's my second fit, if not my first favorite genre of movies. But horror games, where I'm involved in something, involved in the action, I'd rather not. <laughs> We're gonna be playing Poppy Playtime, and uh, I, I've seen a little bit of the game. I'm not gonna lie, I've seen a little bit of it. And I was laughing my ass off because of how scared the people were that I was watching. They were scared. Really scared. And if they play horror games, and they're scared like that, how am I supposed to feel? I'm terrified. I'm not going to lie. I'm terrified. I don't know why I'm doing this. For your pleasure, maybe. But anyway, yeah, this is completely different. You got most of you guys have never even seen my face. If you have, it's been about ten years, maybe, when I was like fourteen years old. I'm not twenty four, but I was pretty young. I'm not gonna lie. Most of you, most of my subscribers are from the uh, water bottle popping video. So last time you guys saw me, I was like, uh, no, thirteen, maybe fourteen, fifteen. I'm twenty now, so I probably sound a little bit different. I probably look a little bit different. Um, but yeah, let's just uh, let's just go ahead and jump straight into the video. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Poppy Playtime. Um, so a little background knowledge of this game is that um, apparently, apparently the f this, you start in this factory, and this factory is an old factory used to make toys, apparently. From what I understand, I don't really know if it's going to tell you um, in the game or or if that's just like background knowledge that I should know beforehand or us that, that we should know beforehand. Um, but yeah, it, it was like an old rundown factory that people used to work at and now they don't anymore. And the reason is unknown and we're supposed to go out there and figure out why. Um, <laughs> any... Everything that I know about this game is that there's a tall, lengthy blue guy, and he tries to kill you. That's that's all I know, really. Besides the, a little bit of the background knowledge, um, as to the factory and this old toy uh, factory kind of thing and stuff like that. That's pretty much all I know. Okay, let's just go ahead and jump. Well, straight into the video, I guess. You are about to see the most incredible doll ever invented. Her name is Poppy, and she is the first truly intelligent doll in the world. Okay. A little girl can talk to her. Poppy gives her answers. She is the first doll actually able to have a conversation with a child. I doubt it. Hard to believe? Yes. Just watch. We'll find out. Poppy's as lovable as a real girl, and she talks like one, too. Hi, my name is Poppy. I love you. Can you help me polish my shoes? Yeah. Why, of no. course, Poppy. Just like a real girl, Poppy always wants to look her best. Perfect. Thank you. Yeah, her you're welcome. Her hair is sturdy and won't come out when you brush it. Okay. And smells just like a poppy flower. Is there anything else you'd like to say, Poppy? You. I'm a real girl. Just like you. What's the time? Playtime! And if you've ever wanted to see how all of the nation's favorite toys were created, Playtime Co. is now offering okay. factory tours at just $2.99 a person. An entire hour in the most magical toy factory on Earth. What are you waiting for? Come visit the factory. Oh, okay, yeah, so... Okay, so yeah, that was... 
We're exploring the factory right now of how all the toys are made. Poppy Playtime! Everyone thinks the staff disappeared ten year disappeared is spelt wrong. Uh, disappeared ten years ago. We are still here. We are spelt wrong. Find the flower. Vintage poppy commercial looks like what we just watched. Okay. Oh shit. Okay. Um, I don't. Something to note. I don't normally play games on PC, even though I have a. Uh, I have the PC, I have keyboard and mouse, but usually I just play with controller. So sorry if like I'm like spinning around or like the movement is kind of awkward. It's just cause I'm not really used to the keyboard and mouse kind of thing. So this is the blue guy that I was talking about, like I saw in the beginning. But hang on, hang on, wait. Right there. It sounds like, it sounds like, uh, like someone's like rubbing something. Like, it sounds like this. It's pointing right now. It sounds like this. Like, I don't know. I'm already getting spooked. Uh, this is the blue guy that we saw in the in the intro. Um. Okay. Oh. Okay. Um, it looks like his arms pretty much reach around the entire like walls. It looks like. Poppy wants to play. Uh. Okay. Uh, oh. Okay. Okay, so it kind of looks like the, this door is like has a keypad on it. I don't really know, like, like how how else you're supposed to get in there. I don't really know. Got a weird, creepy doll, and the blue guy's arms just reach around all the walls. Now oil, oil spill, grease me. Oh yeah, okay, yeah, so the blue hands, I, I've seen a little bit of gameplay from this game. You get like these weird like like hands, I guess, and one, one hand's blue, one hand's red, and I mean, I guess you, you use uh, the hands to get, get around the map, I guess. Um, let's check this out. Eat healthy like brawn! Okay, see there's that, that rubbing noise. Sounds like something like grinding. On, on something. Oh shit! It's a train, not like an animal, like eating a carcass or anything. It's, it's this this choo choo train. Game kind of glitched out. Yo, <laughs> yo, hell no! That was not grease or that was not grease from that other uh, toy or whatever. That was blood. And this ain't my blood. It's probably from a... So it looks like we got like uh, green boxes, blue boxes, red boxes as well. Just green, red, and blue boxes. Uh, there's a blue cat with a red present, green bloody toy. I can't get money out of this, can I? Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, I don't know. Cause I know. Being an avid gamer for years and years, uh, I have a feeling that this is the way we need to go. Um, and this is a keypad, but I literally don't see anything to to get through this door. And this is like a color scheme of like these pi pictures. It could be like the red, her red hair, yellow background, blue, and then the white. Uh, 
white text or a skin color. But I still don't know the order. So red. Oh, not purple? Red. Go red, blue. Red, blue, yellow, white. Okay. I'm going to check the. Uh, maybe it's this. Red, the blue guy. Red, blue, black, white, maybe? Okay, there's no black. Never mind. And this brawn guy, brawn the dinosaur. Uh, we'll go with red, yellow, blue, green. Red, yellow, blue, green. Okay, yeah, we'll try the red, blue, yellow, green. A red, red, yellow, blue, green. Oh no. Red, yellow, blue, green. Red, yellow, lighter color, blue, green. Okay, hang on. I gotta try to. I gotta try to figure this out. Red, yellow, red, yellow, blue, white. What? Yo, I'm actually getting stumped. First, first room, I'm stumped a little bit. Green, red, blue. Green, red, blue. Toy boxes, green, red. I'm just gonna consider that red because most of them are, most of the color palette on this thing is red. Green, red, blue. You can't put the same color in twice, so. Fellows, ladies and gents, it's the train cart. You can see the train cart. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't really even think about this. I thought it was just like a little cool little thing in the game, I guess. But the the engine, or the caboose, or the front of the train is green. Next cab is pink. Next one's yellow. Next one's red. I think that could literally be the only other thing that's uh, that could be the answer. Oh no, I don't actually, I don't remember. Remember the color, green, pink, yellow, red, right? Yeah, okay. Green, pink, yellow, red. We'll give that a, a shout, a try. Green, pink, green, pink, yellow. Okay! Took me long enough. Okay. Wait, there's blue one. Wait, hang on, hang on, hang on. I picked up a green one earlier. Remember I saw that the first VHS tape thingy sitting right there after or before I knocked over the computer screen. And this is just sitting around. Hi, my name is Leif Pierre, and I'm the head of innovation here at the Playtime Co. Toy Factory. If you're seeing this, then you're trespassing. Yeah, we play this little tape on loop whenever we close the factory for the day. So, trespasser, just to make you aware, while we pride ourselves primarily on our high-quality toys and excellent child care, we also pride ourselves on our security. For example, this facility is full of hidden motion triggers, which, once set off, will turn on the factory's emergency alarms and directly contact the authorities. And that's one of the more tame aspects of our security system. Tame? No spoilers. So, you've got my warning. It's what do you not too mean? late to turn around. I just hope that you're certain whatever you're doing is worth it. Shit, after that, I hope so too. So pretty much that was like an like a little sneak peek, I guess. I don't really know. Like uh They said like this like the least amount of least dangerous amount of security, I guess, that they're trying to pull. And then I just picked up a blue one here. There's a blue one. I don't know if there's going to be more of these. There probably will be. Let's see what this is. Oh! Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. This is the room where we get the grab pack. Tighten the straps. See, there's the blue hands, red hands kind of thing. Pull trigger to fire. Pull again to retract. Hold to grip onto object. 
only fire at small objects slash handles. Do not fire at a coworker. This may cause injury. Wire is conductive, used for rewiring. Okay. Oh, I didn't see what that last thing said. I was thinking. What's the time? Play time. Alright, it's mine. It's mine. Let's go! Oh, I thought I saw like a weird like writing on it. Can I grab this? See how far I can go with it? Out the door. Oh! You're mine! Made her catch. I got the computer screen. Monitor. Computer. Again. Let's go. Oh my god. The train got me again. I thought something was like scratching like at the walls or something. Yeah, this is what I was talking about earlier. That's not grease or uh like oil. That's blood. Little size difference. It's a little strange. No. No, no. Yep, yeah, I'm done. Uh, I'll clock in tomorrow. Uh, I'll be I'll be back tomorrow. I can't do this. Okay, yeah. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> Please stop. So this is like, in the trailer, this is the guy that gets you. Apparently, I guess. I mean, that's what happens in the trailer. I don't really know, uh. You guys see that? Look at that face of pure terror. He, right now, he doesn't look as bad, but that's still just that's still creepy. Looks like he's got like uh like Velcro like padding like he kind of looks like he's got the Velcro padding on his hands. Like I don't know if you guys have ever been to like a zoo or anything like that, or like with the sometimes the stuffed animals they have like like a monkey specifically they have like Velcro on their palms and you can like wrap them around each other on their on their like connect the hands kind of thing and you can like put it around your neck or on the bottom feet you can put it around your waist and it's like a little like it kind of looks like a monkey wrapping around you kind of thing um uh, it's kind of what this guy looks like he has on his hands um or it's either like velcro or uh magnus maybe i don't know oh okay huggy wuggy uh, 1984 is the, the the year he was created. Playtime Company has designed hundreds of distinct toys, but none connected with people more than that of Huggy Wuggy. Our founder, Elliot Ludwig, aimed to create a toy which could hug you forever. As is always true, Playtime Company's four-step process to creating the most lifelike toys was a success. So it's kind of right, like the... It's... it's Huggy Wuggy, he's like supposed to be giving you like a hug kind of thing at, at like all times, I guess. So maybe that is like a Velcro on his hands or something. I don't know. With a bit of string and polyester, our lovable blue pal Huggy was brought to life. Huggy was Huggy Wuggy has gone on to be Playtime Company's most popular and best selling toy so far. Somebody came in here and stole the toys or something. Okay, okay. This is kind of weird. Kind of weird looking. Oh god! Look at this one! Yo, no, no, no. Why is this one so creepy? Oh, okay, okay. That kind of freaked me out. I thought it had like a, like a string around his neck like he was hanging. Goodness gracious. 
Oh, he's got a name in blocks. Okay. Um. Right now. So yeah, you need both the hands to get to this door. There's Bron, Bron the dinosaur. Some cat. There's that that doll girl thing. What was your name? Like Polly? Uh, yeah, Polly, Polly the doll or something like that. And there's a blue guy, the huggy huggy guy. This guy seems like I made a. Oh. I heard like some keys drop, but oh, huggy, huggy! Thanks, thanks, buddy. Little pat in the chest. I kind of wish you could just like grab his face and just rip it right off, like it says not to do. Um, so we lost power to this. Can't open it. Okay. I have a feeling these doors are locked. This is only chapter one as well, guys, so stay tuned for chapter two. Um guys, I'm feeling that that's where chapter two is gonna take place is in this room or in one of these other rooms or doors, I guess. Oh yeah, I suppose uh the connection thing came through this door. Makes sense. Staff only, that's me! Dear, dear God! It's freaky. Is that his girlfriend? Remember, do be kind to others, that's true. Be kind to others. Show up on time if you wanna look good to your boss, show up on time. Do not hide behind doors to scare Lathe Pierre. Why would the do, why would that be under the do not, or the, what? Wh you know what I'm saying? Why would that that bottom one, this green one, be under the do when it has not there? It should be under the don't. Don't stay past 8 p.m. Don't misuse company time. Don't tamper with machinery. Don't enter innovation wing without authorization. Good thing we can't get in there. Oh, okay. So we're gonna be doing a little bit of troubleshooting. Oh, okay, so arm is energized. A little bit of conductivity. Where do I go with this? Okay, so it goes through the wall. Yo! Look at all the blood on the walls. This bloody toy in the ceiling. Okay, so that seems right. Okay, so there's like a, a length, a certain length you can go, I guess. Hey, hey, why are you stuck? Why are you stuck like that? Did I lose it here? Oh god, hang on, hang on. This one. Nothing back there. This game's kind of dark, not gonna lie. Oh, there's one. Can I reach it? Yo, guys. <clears throat> uh, when we got the power back on. For the splittest second of all time, I could have sworn I just saw that blue guy just dart away. Like, just full on sprint. Now, maybe I should go back home. I, I think uh, I forgot to turn the oven off. Gone. Yo, I can't do this. Oh, I, I literally can't do that. I need the I need the right hand. 
Okay, we're not leaving. That's the way we came in. Okay, we literally can't leave now. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. Let's go. Can you get yum? Make a friend hallway. I can't do this. I can't do this. I don't know if you guys just saw it. This, this blue guy's hand was snaked up around this pink one. No, no, no I'm not going that way. And he went through this doorway, by the way. I'm not going that way. I'm actually not going that way. Okay, maybe I am. Maybe, maybe I am. You know, I quit. I'm not, I'm not staffed no more. I, I can't do this. I can't do this. I'm going home. I'm going home. I can't do this. Okay, no, never mind. I actually have to do this. This camera better be recording. Yo, what? No, don't tell me he's standing right there. Oh, no, that's the second like wallpaper. Yo, what? Yo, what? Do I not go this way? Oh shit. I thought we were in luck. I thought I thought we weren't going this way. No, no, I can't do this. I don't know if you guys saw it in the beginning, but his arm was like sick. Oh! Yo. I need I need a heart monitor. I need a heart monitor ASAP. <laughs> Get me on a heart monitor. I can't do this anymore. Okay, let's just keep on. Oh my god, my heart. I thought my heart just launched out of my throat. Oh my god. I kinda hurt. It's probably my screaming. Okay, now we literally oh. I have to press the interacting button. Of course. I told you I'm new. I'm new to keyboard. Okay. Okay. So we got another orange. Uh, D what do you call those v VHS uh, players? Or DVD player things. Huggy says, "Remember to take breaks." So we gotta find some more of the, um, like bulbs, I guess. What do you call those bulbs? Whee! Yo! Oh my god! Oh my god! Did I just get scared by a cardboard box? Maybe. Okay, it's a shortcut. Creepy ass doll. Get out of here. Couple toys. You can't go down these, can you? Please don't tell me you can. No, I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. Which one was that? Is that was that red or yellow? Oh. No, I'm not playing with Poppy no more. Never was, never, never am going to do. Oh, we just have to look for the VHS orange tape thing. Oh, let me look at here. That was easy. Play, play the sound effect. Nicole. 
closer. Rich, where are they keeping the huggy boxes? I don't know. I couldn't tell you. Remember when maintenance left in a sweep of this place? <laughs> no. Exactly. Nobody in this stupid company knows what they're doing. Oh, I swear, I haven't seen a single box in its place since they started flooding the storehouse with orphanage junk. Right. I get it. It's a nice program and all on brand. But, uh, it's just hard to be happy about it when manufacturing's on our necks about it, because we can't buy stupid hockey boxes! Rich. Oh, you're right. You're right. It's... It's for the orphans. I just wish there were less boxes. But, uh... Anything less would be more habitable. Is, is that even a word? A bit of I, I don't think so. I don't think it is. So apparently, all these gifts or boxes, at least the boxes are anything. The boxes are all like made for orphan kids, I guess, or like uh, like the, the toys are being sent out. <laughs> no, no. Yo, my heart is racing. I actually might have a heart attack. Okay, let's just get these in here. So, what I was saying was, I think the toys and boxes, I'm pretty sure the toys are going to be in the boxes, so technically the boxes are being sent out to the orphans. Some orphans, I don't know who or what or why. But, the toys for orphans, I guess. Oh! There's a red hand. The claw. Let's go! Let's go! Raise the, raise the roof! Okay... I don't think there's anything. And Mr. Blueface Man went through that door, which is fine by me! Okay, so you gotta charge him. Do not tell me I'm going in there. I'm not going in there. I'm not. I'm not. Okay, I have to. Crouch. Over. Okay. <laughs> I can't do this. Pins? I can't make it up it. Oh! Pretty me. Okay, so the rolling pins you cannot go up. And I don't really know what that's about. So, oh, okay. Wait, so you take... Okay, I'm taking that, I guess. I just don't want to see this blue guy. Okay, here we go! We're rolling in the deep. No, if he comes in here right now... I'm done, I'm done. Yo, stop. Oh! Holy sh... Oh yeah, scary. Yo, stop, 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 stop. Okay, game goes out a little bit. Okay, so he pretty much just came from the 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 factory, like where the toys come from, I guess. reminds me of like a like the luggage like when you're in an airport and you're going through like the luggage conveyor belt thing y you don't go through it but your luggage does <laughs> got another thing here uh, uh what do you call it info board i guess make a friend founded in 1960 our founder elliot ludwig was a visionary he set the stage oops sorry about that 
He set the stage for all of Playtime Company's greatest feats, and all of the amazing things that he created. The Make a Friend machine is one of the most creative, impressive, and advanced. It is solely responsible for nearly every Playtime Company toy sold on the market to this day. All it needs is to be fed the proper parts, and it will then paint, assemble, and do a quality inspection of the toy all on its own. Gone is the need for the complex sorting or back-breaking labor. This machine can do all that and more. Sounds like me. Just a tank. Brutal machine. So you can't turn these on? Yo, I scared myself. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. Go to the top. Here we go. I hope that's rust. I hope that's rust. Oh, dope. Get another pink one. Okay, you gotta look for a pink DVD disc. Or not DVD, uh, uh actually I just see it. There it is. Just gonna play that now, might as well. So, Stella, what made you wanna work at the Playtime Co. Factory? Playing with toys when I was young was so magical. I could go straight from my bedroom floor to anywhere in the world. Okay. It was such a great feeling. And being able to work at a toy factory, somewhere that can provide kids with that same experience, okay. that's a pretty great feeling too. Sometimes though, I really, really wish I could go back. To being a kid, I mean. And it's weird, because... We Adults are just kids, but older. I don't think anyone ever really feels like an adult. Yeah. But your body just gets older yeah. and older, yeah. and then you die. Poof. <laughs> Human bodies just can't stay young forever. Stella, you're fired! There's things, though. Like some trees that can stay alive even while being way older than a person. I mean, the oldest people to ever live are still younger than those. So I guess everyone is always young relative to something. What right? is she on about? All right, I think we're getting a little off track. Yeah. Yeah, we were. Okay, yeah, this seems to look like rust. But you never know. You never know. Oh! Oh my gosh! Oh, the game was glitching out. I thought we were falling to our death right there. I thought we were gone. Oh. Oh, wow. Would you look at that? Wow. What a bridge. Okay. So I'm assuming we got to get both, both of those. And then... To this. Okay. Yo, what? This thing is trying to chuck me off the, chuck me off of the thing. What if I went the other way, the other one first. This one, is this one. No, this is gonna be even longer. Yeah, it doesn't make sense. I wonder if I can use like. Like, go around this way. Around the corner. Oh my gosh, we're so close. Oh no. Charge. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Shoot, shoot the hand, shoot the hand. Touch the button, touch the button. Touch it, touch it, touch it, touch it. Touch it. Yo, we are so close. Wait, can I, can I cheat code this? Not cheat code, but cheat it. Oh! oh! Uh. Yo, what? That's my heartbeat. It was going crazy. The game could feel it in my in real life. They could feel it. Put in the game for me. 
Man, this character's kind of slow, not gonna lie. Okay, I'm actually kind of lost. Because it doesn't reach either way. If you go like this way, it doesn't reach. Actually, I'm gonna try something. Oops. Yeah, pull this one. Come this way. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, no, go, 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 go. Okay, yeah, that's not right. That can't be right. If I really want to fall down again, that's just going to waste time. Okay, uh, I'm just going to cut this until I figure out the solution. Because I don't want to waste your guys' time. So I'll see you guys when I when I get this. I just barely saw that at the end. All I saw was this thing getting electrocuted. So hopefully it works now. But as being an electrician, that's my job by the way, I'm an electrician and outside of YouTube. Um, the power went to this thing, so the power must have come from this thing. Under that bridge, looks like up the wall maybe. Around the thing and here. So I'm assuming. I'm assuming that thing works now. I don't know if I can survive the fall, and I don't really want to try it. So I'll just kind of run down the stairs. I guess maybe take a couple, a couple flights of stairs. Okay, we're jumping off here. Never mind. Okay, all right. We need to pull down there. Okay, I got to block exit the power. <laughs> oh my god. Yo, my heart is beating out of my chest right now. That's not even funny. Did anything come out of that one? Oh, I see our legs. Legs, head. We need the body. Okay, okay. The head. Oh. Is it done? Oh. The body got sent through, I guess. Probably launched through. You probably didn't see it when I almost had a cardiac arrest right there. So they came through here, now they're painted it looks like. Now they're getting crushed up. The big old Oh, there it is! Yo, something about this red one? Something about this red one? Its eyes follow you around. And now my toy's destroyed. I don't know how that worked. I don't know. Oh yeah, look at this thing. The eyes like follow you around. Talk about like a haunted, uh, haunted factory. Oh, catch it, catch it! Okay, we got it. Yo, I do not want to see that blue guy like running around up there, like, like going down the thing and like just peeking over. I think I'd have to quit the game. Or back here, oh my god. Hanging from the ceiling somewhere? Nobody leaves without a toy! Get scanned, get scanned. It's kinda of off-putting. I don't know about that. Stay away to hell. Staff only.
No. No. No, 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 no. No, I'm not going in there. Look how dark it is. Yo, my heart is racing. No, no, run! Yo, my heart's racing. Oh! oh my god, oh my god. Yo, yo, run faster, run faster, run faster. Yo, I almost got shot right there. Yo, is he behind us? Oh my god! Oh my god! We're going fast. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, can't go there. Oh my god. Oh my god. Don't tell me he's right there, actually. Don't tell me. Don't tell me. No. No! 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 No, don't tell me. Hurry up! <laughs> Yo, get me over. Oh, get no! no! Oh! Hey, I'm floating. I'm floating. Am I supposed to be up here? Why not? Oh! Yo, my throat hurts. Yo, is that? What is that? All I saw was him start fall. He fell down a couple times. And now there's blood everywhere. There's blood on the on the same path as me. On the same railing. Yo, there's how's how's that blue guy filled with blood? Oh hey! <clears throat> Do not tell me I'm gonna be down there running away for my life. Do not tell me. Do not tell me. He's gonna start like crawling around. Oh my gosh. Yeah, there's the poppy leaf flower thing we're looking for. <clears throat> poppy? Poppy flower, as in like a poppy playtime, as in like the poppy doll? Should be worried. Yo, that's not in game, is it? That was in the TV, right? I'm just gonna assume that was in the TV because we're not dead. Turns out that guy got destroyed. <clears throat> it looks, sounds like it anyway. Kind of sounded like he's warning us about something. Probably the blue guy. Um, no, 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 no. Bro, no! Get down, get down. Cut, cut, not cut. Oh God, don't, no, no, not cut, not cut. I mean, quit, quit hanging yourself. Come on. So literally, it, literally this is saying go anywhere but this door. It said no run, no stop, go back, run. Stop, it looks like. Stop, maybe. Stop down there. No stop, turn around, danger, run. Don't gotta tell me twice. I just kidding. We gotta. 
I'm assuming we got a game here. Is this somebody's house? Yo. No, no, I don't like this at all, actually. If he starts, like, if he's down here and he's, like, like, super tall, hunched over like he was before, and he's just ripping through the walls. Can I even, can I even run up these stairs? Not run, but I can walk. I hope you guys can hear this, but there's, like, a lullaby going on right now. No, no, no. <laughs> no, I don't like this cabinet. I don't like this. Was this a dresser? I don't like that. It's blocking a door, a small door. No, 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 no. Nothing's gonna like push off this bookshelf and come running at me, I hope. Nothing in there. Oh no, no. <clears throat> Don't tell me that. I'm gonna have to run. Can I open it from back here? Come on. Why the music stop? Okay. It turns on as soon as I say something. <clears throat> let me let me just grab this wallpaper that's falling off and just cover up your face real quick. Or even even better, just No! No! I meant to I meant to cover her face, not grab the handle. Oh, I thought it was gonna be stuck there. Oh god, no, 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 no. Nothing's gonna, nothing's gonna run through that, that dresser, is it? I'm opening it up way back here, as far as I can. You opened my case. Oh my God! Chapter one at Tie Squeeze, game director Isaac Christopherson, executive producer Zach Bellinger, story by Zach and Seth Bellinger. Zach, I can't read that fast, even though it's going slow. I need to catch my breath. Well, that is the end of uh, <laughs> Bobby Play Time Chapter One. Um, this game. I, I, as I've said multiple times already, I hate horror games, and this game, this game is different. It's not your typical shoot zombie, this is kind of stereotypical, shoot zombie or get like jump scared by a ghost kind of thing. This actually had like puzzle solving and like brainstorming, things what you actually have to do. Oh, okay, I'm super bright again. I'm gonna turn this down kind of a little bit. This was the best and most fun and entertaining horror game I've ever played. Saying I've only played like maybe, this might be my third horror game maybe ever. I've never finished the other horror games because I'm too scared, too much of a crybaby I guess you could call me. This was awesome. Chapter one, awesome. I love the I love the puzzle techniques that you need to use to get around the map and progress through. I love the puzzles. I, I, I kept, it keeps my brain active, I guess, in a way. I don't know. Congratulations to the people who made this game. You have officially made 
the funnest horror game that I think I've ever played. Um, I don't like horror games, but this game might just change that. I, I don't know what was so fun about it, but being being scared shitless and screaming my lungs off my body, it was a little bit different, a little, a little more fun. I, I hope you guys enjoyed watching me suffer uh, as much as I was suffering. Um, but yeah, you guys did an amazing job on chapter one. I. I kind of desperately need chapter two out right now so I can play it. I actually want to, I want to know more about this game. Now I'm curious, like it, it kind of reminds me of Five Nights at Freddy's, not going to lie a little bit, which is cool because that game was amazing from what I've heard and what I've seen. Uh, I've seen Markiplier play it a couple times. So it's a little bit. It's like animatronics, things that shouldn't move or shouldn't have like lifelike features. They do. Looks like the purple or the blue, not purple, the blue huggy wuggy guy. It was scary as you guys saw and saw me reacting to him be scary that was awesome i can't wait to see what's in chapter two i, I want to know if huggy wuggy comes back from the dead whatever happened to that guy i don't know um i want to know who the heck poppy that poppy chick is the poppy doll she uh she's kind of mysterious a little strange you know what i'm saying um but yeah, I hope you guys come out with chapter two soon because I kind of need to play that now, like ASAP. Uh, if you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. It'd be greatly appreciated. If you guys want to see me do more Poppy Playtime, more horror games, also like the video so I know you guys like this kind of content. It's, it's very different from my original content of like Call of Duty, Black Ops, Zombies. It's completely different, but I'm not going to lie. I have a feeling this game will make a comeback onto this channel at least one more time at least one more time if you guys want to see the video cool i'll post it if you guys like it i'll post it even faster um if you guys don't like it i don't care i'm still going to post it that's because how i work i'm just going to post a video of me playing this game and i hope you guys would enjoy watching me get scared countless times over this game just comment down below if you guys want to see me play chapter two like the video if you want to see me play chapter two also comment down below if you guys want to see me play any other horror game i was thinking about playing outlast i know that game is terrifying i also got a recommendation to play phasmophobia uh, that game's actually kind of newer i think from what i know and that's like a ghost hunting video game i guess which would be kind of interesting but yeah, different from the channel kind of different from this this kind of a uh, play style i think i haven't really seen too many videos about either of the games um, which is probably a good thing if I'm going to be doing a video about it. If you guys want to see chapter two of this game, comment down below. If you guys have any other video game ideas you guys want to see on the channel, me react to, me play, do a walkthrough, let's play, whatever you want to call it, comment the, comment the name of the game down below and I'll probably buy it and I'll make a video of me playing the game. And, uh, yeah, subscribe if you guys like this video. Um, subscribe if you guys want to see more content like this. And I will see you guys in the next video.